This episode of Hack 5 is brought to you by Toyota. For Hack 5, I'm Darren Kitchen here at CES 2014, checking out some really cool stuff from Texas Instruments. You guys know I'm a huge fan of DLP. Look at this. I, I mean, this thing is itsy bitsy teeny weeny, and what's inside of here is nearly a million little less than the size of a human hair mirrors that are all independently controlled to refract light and do freaking awesome stuff. And so, okay, I mean, the technology aside, like, of course, you know, I want to talk to advocates. I want to talk about the te technology behind behind it. But you probably want to know, like, what's the practical stuff that you can do with that? Well, this is really interesting out of a Korean manufacturer that's taken this DLP technology into, like, the nano size. Look at this. This is the Seiko Nix DLP from TI that they've put into this tiny, tiny form factor. And as you can see here, all we actually have is micro USB and a focusing element. There's not a fan in here. There's not a heat sink in here. It's pretty cool. They've got it hooked up to a laptop over USB, so it's not like HDMI in or anything like that. So don't ask me about the connectivity. All I know is it's NHD, which is code for 640 by 360, but still ridiculously cool. Now, it's not mega throw for how small it is, but that's fine. What I'm thinking is look how tiny this thing is. Imagine LED throwies except LED projectees? I don't know, that's the kind of cool stuff that's going to evolve out of this kind of a technology. And TI is even talking about open hardware platforms that interface with this kind of stuff. So I'm very hopeful to find out more about that in the future. But I thought I would show you a really cool implementation of what can be done with these nearly a million tiny hair sized, sub hair sized mirrors. Um, the Seiko Nix, check it out. Thanks once again to Toyota for sponsoring our CES coverage.